okay. This is a pocket watch. It's old. It's got yeah. Ward's safety pinion on it. Like what? What? What's that about? Oh, and it's got patent pinion yeah, there. Yeah, there's two names for it. There's safety pinion and patent pinion. So what? So what? What's a pinion? A pinion's a little gear that's on the big gear that's on the watch. That's your opinion. That that's is not opinion. My opinion. <laughs> the, <laughs> the watch has the watch has <laughs> gears in it. Uh huh. And the gears are called uh, wheels. But uh, the gears are called wheels. Well, when, in the watch repair business, the watch. So the repair, gear is the same thing as wheel. Yeah, yeah the gear is the same thing. So as So those wheel. big things that that have the little doodads in them, like that, yeah. is is called a wheel, and yes, it's also called a gear. Yes. The, uh, the gear isn't just the part in the middle. No, that that's the pinion. The part in the middle is the shiny silver part, and the middle is the pinion. Oh, you're talking about the round thing, but not mm-hmm. the thing that goes the shaft that goes that's through the it. Shaft. Oh, the shaft. <laughs> I got that one right. Okay. Woo. Okay. So, okay. So the pinion is the little round thing. Yes, All right. And it looks like a tiny gear. So don't, don't, now this is an old watch. Yeah. This right. Is like it's from the 1800s it's or a, something. Yes. This watch is from the 1880. Right. Okay. So, so we don't have pinions. We don't have opinions. <laughs> we don't have opinions now in our pocket watches. If anybody has a pocket watch now. No, I don't. The pocket watches, uh, the big 18 size pocket watches, the mainspring was so big and, and powerful because the watch was so big that they uh, needed the safety pinion. Because if the mainspring broke on the um, that big pocket watch, it was really had a lot of tension on it. And so when it released that tension, it caused the um, mainspring. And the mainspring is inside a, a little box kind of thing. It's called a barrel. Ah. And so when that, when that spring broke, it spins the barrel in reverse counterclockwise. And the watch isn't made to spin counterclockwise. The gears aren't. Ah. Yeah, the gears. So messes it up pretty bad. Yeah, it breaks. It tears all the teeth off the gears. It breaks little delicate parts in the watch and... So uh, this man, Charles Fogg, mm-hmm. Charles W. Fogg, mm-hmm. he invented the safety pinion in 1865 to, to take care of that problem of the mainspring breaking all these watches. So, is it like, what is, so what does the pinion do to make sure? Like, I don't understand how that well, the works. Pinion, the, 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 the safety pinion is on one of the gears or wheels that's in the center of the watch. And it's called the center wheel. And that's it, that big one. That's the big, the big, the biggest gear in okay. the watch is called the the center wheel. Okay. And so the the um, safety pinion is on that that gear on the shaft, and the shaft is uh, threaded like a screw, and the safety pinion is like a nut. If you look at a screw. It's threaded, and you thread a nut onto the screw. Mm-hmm. Well, that's the same way the safety pinion is, but it has reverse threads on it. So when the, it spins off of the the um, shaft in reverse, when the uh, mainspring breaks and the barrel spins in reverse, so both of them spin in reverse together, and that saves the um, pocket watch. From being damaged. And well, how can it have reverse threads? Like, what's a reverse thread? A thread is a thread. Like, no, how is it reverse? If you think of threading or tightening a book, a, a, a bolt, yeah. it's always right. You always turn it right. It's righty tighty, lefty loosey. But on a reverse thread, when it spins on the right, spins right, it's unthreading it instead of tightening it like it should not like a normal bolt does so that's what a reverse thread does so that's what it does it takes care of any problems that would happen if the mainspring broke and it keeps the watch from being damaged so i hope you liked this video and if you did hit the like button and also subscribe to my channel to see more watch videos have a great day well, thanks for watching the video, and I hope you liked it. If you did, 
hit the like button, and also subscribe to my channel to see more of my videos.